Hello, Gentleman Gamer here, and today I'm playing EVE Online, and I'm uh, continuing my exploration run that I started a couple days ago. Um, of course, it's been it's been, a, been going a little longer than I thought it would. Uh, I started in Amar Space in low sec, and I couldn't find a decent uh, low sec to null sec connection. I only found one, and it was very, very active, and I decided to bug out of there. Um, so I got a little impatient, I jumped into a wormhole system instead, and I did find another connection from um, that wormhole system into <laughs> into a, a high-sec system in Kaldari space. Uh, so I landed in there, and then I went into the low-sec in Black Rise, and I finally found another null-sec connection right here, and I have to hurry because it might die on me <laughs> by the time I finish this video. Uh, but before I jump through there into that uh, system, I do want to tr um, try out this data analyzer I have. Well, data and relic analyzer. It's uh, one of the newer modules. I haven't tried it yet, but it, uh, it can do data and relic sites. But it has some drawbacks, um, like uh, the utility slots are, are actually one lower. I think the virus, uh, virus coherence is also lower too. But you get to use, um, you have to do both data and relic sites, and it frees up a mid slot, which is important because, and if you saw my last video, I was trying to catch a uh, Wayward Explorer, and because he was triple stabbed, he ran away. So I tried to remedy that with uh, two Warp Scrambler 2s here, and I kept put this module in there so I can still do data and relic sites. Uh, I know some people in the, in the comment section were saying, just get a, uh, a Faction Warp Scrambler, which has three points of strength instead of two. And I was, I was, I was going to go with that, but because this character uh, has to deal with War Decks, um, I didn't have access to Amar at the time. And my hauling alt is somewhere in Nulsec. <laughs> I totally forgot he was there. Uh, so I didn't have time to go back and forth trying to get the module. So I just got another Tech 2 and put it in here. And I actually uh, bought one of these outside of Amar. And they're pretty close in price. I think the Faction Scram is like 44 mil. And this is like 50 mil, I think, outside of Amar. So I still get the desired effect. I do rather, I, I would rather go with a two dedicated mods for the delic dele oh <laughs> the words are hard the data and relic uh just because they're just better in general but i do want to try this mod anyway so i found a site here i'm going to run it and to see how this works now of course it's probably not uh the best site to test it on uh null sec and wormhole space are the hardest sites but i think it's a, it's a it'd be a decent test uh to see how this works and there's no one in local here, which is good. I don't have to worry about that. Let's see here. Only three. <laughs> oh, man. I have not done uh, sites in low sec in a while. So I'm actually not sure what the the average is here. Let's go to the closest one. We'll lock it up. Okay. Was it 6,000 meters still? Yeah, okay. Right, check. Keep an eye on local. Make sure no one jumps in here. Come on, come on, come on. Faster, faster, faster. It's just not far away enough to put the micro warp drive on. There we go. All right, let's try this out. Yeah, let's go the other way. Oh, no, got to take one of these out. Huh, okay. Oh, I got one utility slot, so let's use it up now. No, not down there. There we go. Alright, that was an easy hack, though. Let's see. Not much. <laughs> okay. I wasn't expecting much, but we'll keep going here. Put the micro drive to get the other one pretty quick. Alrighty. On target this one so I don't confuse myself. And we'll turn right for about now. I always overshoot it when I have the micro warp drive. I end up bouncing. I gotta st stop the ship. That's a couple times I failed the hack because I'm not paying attention. And let's not do that this time. Alright, it's a little bigger. A little bigger, um... I'm not sure you call it grid or... A little bigger this time. Let's just do that automatically. Oop, let's keep going up. One, two, one. Hmm. Over here, maybe? Nope. Oh. Use that again. No. There we go. What's this? Talican automation accounts? 
I wonder what that is. I never got that before. Um, that's garbage. Carbon's garbage. I'll, I'll get that. I never saw one of those before. I'm not sure what they're used for. All right. Last one. So far, it's working pretty good. These sites, these hacks are pretty easy, though. It might not be the best test for it. But I do know I have to change my behavior slightly. Because I can't hold as many um, of those uh, those power-ups, I guess you would call it, in the utility slots. Because I only have one. So this change behavior slightly with that. You gotta use them as you get them. Let's stop right there. No one the logo still. Good, good, good. And let's try this one. Okay, a little bigger hack. Maybe this would be a little better test for it. Just just use it automatically. One. And let's go to that guy. Another one? <laughs> use automatic. Just keep using them. Okay, good. Uh let's see. No, that's the wrong way, maybe. Go down this way. One. Oh, nice. Okay, good. We got it. Again, not very hard hacks here. I have to wait to get into Nullsec, maybe. Just really test it. Uh, what is this? Mostly garbage, it looks like. I'll take it. Why not? All right. So, all in all, it wasn't that... It um, wasn't a good, very good test, I don't think. Let's um, let's check. We're almost all there, right? <laughs> that's good. Let's go check out the wormhole I found and see what part of Nullsec it takes us in. But all in all, that, that right here it worked out pretty good. So maybe, maybe not the best test, but I'll uh, I'll try going. I'll go into Nullsec, see if I can find a site or two in there and test it there because that's that's where the hardest sites are. Where is this taking us, huh? It's greenish. Also about to collapse. It looks like. So let's just jump in. I'll find out where we're going real quick. Come on, go go, go go. There we go. All right, where are you taking us? Uh, no one in local. De Detroit, Detroit region. Two signatures. One being this wormhole. We'll see if we'll get lucky. Let's see if one of these, the other signature is, um, is uh, a site of some kind. Let's make a quick safe spot, which is always important. Right about there. No, but, um, once we land, we'll drop the um, drop the probes and have a look around. I don't think I've been in this this um, this region before. Not that I remember, anyway. And we'll drop probes there, cloak up again, and let's see here. Now I have. Where's my bookmark for the wormhole? Um, right there. So I'm going to take a gamble and say this signature is the wormhole, and we'll go search, uh, go um, scan this one down. Oop. Local. Okay, no one local. Been pretty lucky with the, uh, <laughs> the, the the busyness of these systems. Okay. The, la the first, the only no other no second shot I found was in um, Declan, and uh, that was very busy. <laughs> okay, combat site. Okay, that's not helpful at all. Let's let's keep moving here. Uh, where? Pull the let's pull the probes in, decloak, reload them. Let's see, not there. Oh, actually, oh, they put the description back in. I do want to read the description of these because they put them back in. But let's take a look at where we're going to go next here. We have two. All right, check this one out first. Sovereignty. Oh, no military or or industry index. We're not using this system at all. All right, let's go back. Might be a good bet uh, for, for safety. Right, this one, too. Even the strategic index down. I mean, they they got it pretty recently, huh? All right. Well, maybe we'll um we'll try for that bottom one, less active as possible. <laughs> Let's go for this one. Was it that one? Which one was it? Uh, no, adjacent systems. ETAC. Yeah. Let's go to the ETAC one. ETAC one. All right. We'll see how um, how busy this this region is. Who runs it right now? Uh, Stella Nova. Hmm. 
don't think I've heard of them before. Can I get the info on them? There we go. Okay. How many people do they have? Any members they have in this? Oh, quite a bit, of, quite a quite a bunch of corporations. I'm not sure how many. They don't tell you how many people there are through the the alliance information, though. Let's see here. Who runs this one? Again, empty. Two signatures. No one in local. Individa Gloria comes. Um, okay. No stations either. Huh. All right. Let's uh, go to a planet. We'll drop probes in the meantime. Come go scanning. We'll cloak up and make a safe, which is always a good idea. Control B. Wait till we get away from the gate. That's good. Safe. Alrighty. Which one should we scan first? This one? Whoa, okay, let's uh, go that formation. Get really close, like. Yeah, it's pretty, actually, a pretty small signature already. Let's uh, make it a little bigger, just in case. Alright, let's get to our safe spot. Ah, oh, both combat sites. No luck there either. Okay. That is not working. Pull them back in. Alright, this is getting a little more difficult. Alright, let's, um, what else we got here? Uh, STAC. No, it's not so back, but back. Let's go to STAC 5 and see how that looks. That is slightly more active, but not by much. Huh. Well, let, let's go to STAC 5. I see we're a better luck there. So I do want to test this module in a more uh, difficult hack. Alright. Let's take a look at the description here. I want to see how what the description for this place is. In the outer reaches of the south, nestled be behind its formidable neighbors lies... I, I'm going to say... Deroit? <laughs> Deroit? I'm probably saying that terribly. This unassuming region is what is home to have become termed dead storms. A phenomenon thus far not found anywhere else. They appear randomly, center around planets, ravage the area for days, then abruptly vanish. Huh. No sights here at all. All right. Let's keep moving here. Uh, attack A. Let's see what that one looks like. Sovereignty. This one is definitely more active. Let's see if we can avoid that one. How about uh, that one? That is slightly, that's way less active, but there are some people using it. So we'll take take a look at that one. No one in system. So I can just go to gate, go right to gate to gate. Usually it's not safe going gate to gate, guys, but no one's in local for the past two, two systems so far. So I'm, I'm, I think I'm safe doing it. We'll cloak up just in case someone comes in local though. Um, Right, keep going here. Scientists have had relatively few chances to travel to the region to study dead storms, as I think it's Deroit, maybe, once marked the edge of the Joe Vampire, now lives within Angel Caught Territory. Current theory points out the storms being tears in the fabric of space. Why they exist in the first place, or the reason for their being focused around certain planets, remain, myster remain mysteries, and will no doubt be for some time yet. Well, that's interesting. That's cool. I, I kind of I kind of wish that these descriptions of the regions had effect on the space like you can see these storms and I, I never heard even heard of this so I kind of wish they would actually be seen in the game I, I'm not sure if actually the effect <laughs> affect gameplay which still be cool but I kind of wish they actually put them in the game because that's a really cool feature if the space had that feature <laughs> random <laughs> random storms attacking ships well destroying ships anyway Kind of like uh, in the old stories of the high seas, where you know uh, they would have, um, <laughs> they would have like mally storms, like like suck up ships. Anyway, let's put the probes up. We got three signatures to scan. Again, the routine, safe spot because I haven't been in this region uh, about now. That's good. And let's start scanning. This, this space is pretty dead though. There's kind of kind of weird. I'm not sure where this is exactly on the map, but a lot of the space I have been exploring 
Um, usually it's pretty lived in. Okay, let's start scanning here. Am I cloaked up? Yes, very good. Okay, let's um, let's focus on these ones so they're clustered together. Maybe I can get a quick read on them. Hopefully they're not combat sites. Come on, not combat sites. Oh, combat sites. There's so many combat sites out here. All right, come on. They're my only hope, last signature. Come on. I'll even take a data site. Even a data site I'll take. Uh, let's see. Okay. Come on. <clears throat> All right. Come out from here. Move this down here. Move this back up. All right. Let's scan again. <laughs> oh, come on. Please don't be a comet site. A wormhole. That is not what I want right now. <laughs> you know what? We'll just scan it down and we'll see if. Uh, if it's a good um, a good exit, just in case I get chased, which doesn't seem to be the case in this this region. <laughs> All right, let's let's check out what this is. I'm going a hundred, just in case. Let's uh, decloak, reload these. Since no one's in local, take advantage of that. We'll see where this one takes. If it takes another null sec, I might just jump through. <laughs> Let's see if we get better luck. My luck, uh, probably not, though. Uh, let's see. what. Where do you take us? Dangerous unknown parts of space. Yeah. <laughs> I don't want to jump into another wormhole right now. Uh, let's uh, go back to the safe spot, and we'll start mapping our, our, next, uh, our next jump here. We were there. I haven't been to this one yet. Let's take a look at this one. Right, the space like this dead. Like, does anyone live here? <laughs> um, I right, will jump into there. Maybe we'll get lucky. R Z tack something. That's great. That no one's in local again. So just jump. Again, usually you do not do this, um, especially gate to gate in nullsec. Uh, two reasons: bubbles being the main problem in nullsec, and secondly, uh, smart bombing battleships. Um, I've been killed what twice from those. <laughs> And they definitely ruin a frigate very quickly. Uh, but since someone's in local uh, for the last, what, three jumps right now, uh, I think it's pretty safe. Oh, <laughs> that's a Mimnotar one. <laughs> the gate looks so cool. Look at that. It looks so neat. It's like a cannon. Ship cannon. Oh, look at that. <laughs> it looks cool. I love the way they look. All right. Lucky, lucky, lucky. Two signatures. No one in local again. Wow, okay. Let's uh, do the routine here. Go to a planet, drops probes, hit the cloak, and make a safe. Right about uh, now. There we go. All right. Let's see here. Uh, I can't double up now. They're all spread apart. So let's do one at a time. Which is annoying because then you have to scan twice as much to get the basic signature. So once you get it to yellow, though, you can tell what kind of um, signature it is. If it's a combat site or, or a hopefully a data relic site. But we'll have to do it this way. So analyze that. All right. <coughs> Maybe guys. Okay, okay, let's go. Now, I remember when I first started playing EVE, and they had the uh, tutorial for scanning, <laughs> and I could not, for the life of me, when I started playing the game, figure out how to scan anything down. It just felt random. <laughs> and I, and since that tutorial, I think when I made this character, for a good year or so, I didn't even try scanning. Like, I didn't even buy the probe line. Another, ah, oh, got another wormhole. <laughs> Alright, but you know, it's good to scan these down in null sec just in case you need to escape. Alright, let's just scan it down. 
and we'll check it out and see where it leads us. Yeah, but the the must have changed scanning from the from the time I, I first started to when I actually started to pick it up again, because I, I actually could finish a scan, actually find something at that point. Alright, warp to that one to see what kind of wormhole that is. In the meantime, as we're traveling there, we'll start um, scanning this signature. Hopefully it's a data relic site. Okay. A K162. Uh, that means a static from a yep, it's from a wormhole space. Uh alright, well this is unknown wormhole. And we'll put um is it one? I type of the dates on these just so I know what they are. Because when you explore a lot, you usually leave lots of bookmarks with his wormhole on it. So I don't want that to happen. Have him build up on me. There we go. I have the, 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 the date and the time. Alright. Hopefully this is a site. I don't want to have to drag this exploration run much longer. At least in the video, anyway. Ooh, okay. Let's get this way closer. Okay, that down here, and we'll shrink the radius. Wow, I'm not getting much luck on this. It's taking so long. Okay, well, let's, um... know what this is. Um, usually, it's take that long, unless it's, like, one of those sleeper cache sites. Which, um... <laughs> if it's anything above a... How do they go? Uh, not superior. Yeah, this is actually... Yeah, it usually takes as long to scan anything down. If it's one of those sleeper sites, I don't think I can run it unless it's the uh, lowest one. Am I still cloaked? Yeah, I'm cloaked. Okay, good. I get, always like get panicked and have to keep looking. It's a relic site. Why is it so hard to scan down, huh? All right, well, that's good. I can test this out properly. Let's shrink this down. Here. Okay. Oh, come on. So close. It usually does not take this long to scan down a site. I wonder what kind of site it is. I know there's different, um, different versions or different kinds of uh, data and relic sites. Ruined Angel Science Outpost. Okay. Well, let's go right to it then, shall we? Alright, put the... Tuck the probes in. I'll get D-Scan ready, just in case someone comes in local. But I'm not thinking it's going to happen anytime soon in this region. Okay. Hopefully there's more than three cans this time. Well, it's pretty far away. <laughs> Oh yeah. Oh god. <laughs> uh, very busy site here. Alright, let's hit the first one. Okay. If I turn this off, I haven't one run on one a cycle. Oh, oh, I hate that. <laughs> Alright, come on, get back close. I don't want to ruin the hack, but getting too far away. I think we're pretty stable now. Alright, let's try it now. Now that's that's a better hack. <laughs> okay, let's see. Two, one, up, oh, okay, good. Four. Now let's keep going this way. One. I can't use that now because I only have one utility slot. So let's just use it on here. Get that. One away. No, two away. No. Five. Oh, okay, I can go that direction. 
Oh. <laughs> Try to avoid those going up here. One. Hmm. Looks like I'm gonna have to kill some of these. Let's work on this one. And we'll go here. Oh, that's not good. That is not good. Let's try to take out this one. Ah, and we found it. Alright, so we use this finally. And we'll just hit some random ones here. There we go. And we got it. Alright. 25 mil. <laughs> I'll take it. So I'll just reload these. Okay, not bad for a first can out here. Now, I, I did notice you do have to be a bit more careful. Um, just because you can't store up those extra... Um, I'm not sure what they're called. I, I call them power-ups. I don't think they're called power-ups. Uh, but you have to... Um, just You can't store them. So you have to be a bit more careful how you use them. Um, but it worked pretty good. I didn't uh, have too much trouble finishing that hack. We'll keep going here. Alright. Pretty big... Um, I guess grid size, we'll call it. Ooh. Not a good start, though. Two away, one away. Oh, that was fast. Never mind. All right, pretty good there. Okay, let's go to the next one. Oh, <laughs> I know Aura's been talking a lot more <laughs> since they changed the uh, the voice actor, and um, I, I don't mind it. I'm just not used to it. Uh, the the the, uh, the drone command was kind of annoying me though when I was a. Uh, uh, using drones to try to kill somebody and uh, I didn't have target yet and they kept saying over and over again you do not have uh, drones have a active targets and <laughs> over and over again uh, but I think because I was dumb and spamming it all right one okay good good start fives um, oh, no let's go this way four three one oh wait heck oh what I do oh no <laughs> Oh, man. I messed up. That's a noob mistake there, guys. All right, come on. Orbit, not fly away. Come on. Try again. Nah, I don't have one chance now because that was cause my dumb mistake. All right. One again. Yeah, all right, good. Let's use that now. One again. Four. Probably not there. Two, hmm. Let's uh, clear this one out. Three, two. Hmm, that's not good. Uh, where should we go? Three, four, five. Nah, four. Hmm, one. Over here. That's not what I need. Let's, uh, let's take this guy out. Let's see if anything's hiding here. Um, it's probably over here. <laughs> I guarantee it. Ah, of course. Um, I got a power up, maybe. That that would be helpful. Now right, we got it. Whew. Almost lost that can because something dumb. I would have lost five mil. That is unacceptable. Oh, <laughs> fine, R. Stop nagging me. These cans are really far away from each other. I'm happy no one's in local. I'll be sweating bullets the entire time. Alright. Probably turn it off from this cycle. Try not to overshoot it again. It's a way to make sure I'm orbiting. I don't want to fly off in the wrong direction. I think we're good now. Let's start it up. Ones. Oh, oh that's useful. Ah, oh, that's useful too. Let's leave it there for now. Three, four, two. No, you have to go. <laughs> uh, down here, maybe. Let's, let's use this one up. One. Oh, got it. Nice. Okay. I'm at that. That tw twenty-five mil can was nice. I have like another couple of those. Would be great. Why do I keep pressing that button? <laughs> Sorry, Aura. I'm terrible at Eve. All right. All right. So far, I haven't missed missed any cans, so I'm not terribly good at the, the hacking game. 
But I haven't messed any cans up other than almost losing because I was flying in the wrong direction. Alrighty. Let's see here. Make sure I'm orbiting. Alright, is it stable? I think so. Oh, that is not good to have around. One, okay. Four. Ah, oh, that's really bad. Oh man, I gotta start getting rid of those. Alright, start taking those guys out. Go for this one. Oh man, that's rough. Oh my god, they're, so, they're everywhere. Oh my god, okay. This is a pro. Oh my god, <laughs> I keep hitting them. Okay, I need this. Um. Uh, man, what can I do? I start going after these guys, I guess. Oh, that drained me though. That was a mistake. On that, okay, I think I'm, I think I'm finished here. I am finished. Oh man, that was rough. All right, the first the first failed hack. We shall try again though. Hopefully, get it the second time. Okay, one. Okay, use that right now. Let's go up. Use that now. Um, I'll take it out. Oh, take it out. <laughs> oh my god. Five. Four, three. Ooh, alright. Let's go this way. I don't know what that is. Ah. Oh. Hmm. Yes, yeah, five's not gonna help us. Let's take a risk. Oh, thank God! Nice, nice, nice. Oh man. Um, five. Not good. Take a risk. Ah, oh, bad risk. All right. I'm taking a gamble and thinking it's here. So let's take these out. Oh, okay. Um. I can't risk this because if I touch this and it's not a power up, I'm locked out of here. I definitely lost the can. Uh, five, five. I might have to try it. Yeah, I have to try it without doing it. Without, I can't risk it. Let's go for it. Oh, okay, good. <laughs> that was close. Oh, six mil. I'll take it. I'll take six mil. One more can. All right. Let's uh, turn the micro warp drive on for speed. Try not to overshoot the can again like a dummy. Turn it off. Make sure I'm orbiting. Oh god. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. Just, just approach. How about that for now? All right. I think, I think I'm stable. Then we go flying off again. All right, let's do it. All right, let's get power up. Oh, all right, I can only hold one, one, five. Oof. Okay, let's go down a little bit. That you are not wanted. Go away. Pick that up. Uh, four. Ugh. No, no, no. <laughs> Uh, go away. Ah, we found you. There we go. All right. <laughs> so all in all, 61 mil so far on this run. Not bad. And the, the module works pretty good, I think. Um, some hiccups, obviously. I did um, the uh, the extra uh, violence scare would have been helpful, especially against those... Um, those uh, those firewall type things that knock down your your strength but i didn't lose any cans so that's good but uh, i think that's all i think i'll end the video here guys uh probably will explore this region a little bit longer and um, i'll show you at the end how much money i get to escape out of assuming i don't die you know uh terribly <laughs> but that that's the video guys uh thanks for watching if you like the video of course leave a like if you like the content of course subscribe and fly safe and fly brave